Hello, welcome to another episode of Initial Speed. Um, first off, I'm going to apologize for not being energetic today. Uh, it's a bit of a painful day, but I'm trying to get something done instead of just lounging around all day in pain. So please excuse if I'm not as energetic and as happy as I normally am. However, in this episode, we are going to be, or I am going to be, uh, converting the European style uh, lug nuts or lug bolts into studs. With being uncomfortable and the kind of pains that I get, um, I think this will make taking the wheels on and off a little bit easier for me. So, come along and see how I make out. Welcome to Initial Speed. The European Stud Conversion Kit. These are the tools that you're going to need to get this job done. The tools you will need is a car, a Euro car to be specific, you will need, well I need to raise the car up, I've got my piece of wood for the uh, jack to be on, more wood for the stands to be on, breaker bar uh, to make the job a little faster, I've got my drill out, torque wrench, uh, there you go, need that for the stud itself and the nut, of course, and it's time to get to work. So converting from this style into this style. So this goes in, holds the wheel on, this goes in, and the wheel sits on here. So a little bit of Loctite, put them in, torque them down, put the wheel on. I believe the Loctite takes about half hour to dry and within 24 hours it's cured. So put this on and uh, by tomorrow this time it'll be completely dry. That doesn't mean now that you can't drive on it. It just means that it won't be fully cured for 24 hours. Now I'm gonna use a little bit of brake cleaner just to be on the safe side, you know? Clean out the holes, the threads. Let that sit and dry for a second. While that's drying, a little bit of Loctite. 
So I've never used Loctite before, but I'm told a little bit Okay, got to puncture it. Puncture it first. <laughs> now let's try that again. Cut the top. Hmm. Comes out pretty quickly. So the other nice thing about converting it to this is if let's say you're running a spacer like I am, the bigger the spacer, the bigger you would need or the longer you would need this bolt. With these, these are nice and long so I can run five mil, 10 mil, 15. I think you can go all the way up to 30 mil with these. So it's one less thing to purchase when you change your offset. With these, you've got to go back every time to get longer and longer ones because you've got to remember this is what holds the wheel to the hub i think this is a better a better move for long term for me not for everybody but for me all right let's let this sit move on to the next one What I'll do is I'll wait for a buddy of mine to come over, or maybe my wife, and get her to stand on the brakes and then I'll just finally snug them all down at the same time. So I'm going to continue and then we'll come back. She'll get in, step on the brake, and I'll come back and torque them properly. I think it's 35 foot-pounds, 35 or 40. I'll look that up in the meantime. Alright, two more, two more uh, wheels to go. Another one. That's the other thing about uh, having the wheel lug nuts the way the Euros do it. When you take it off, sometimes like how you saw me struggle there for a second, it lands, hits the dust shield and bends it in. Then you're driving after you've finished everything because you're focused on you know, what you're doing here, not really here. Then you start hearing a ha ha ha. You start hearing scratching noises. So then you've got to come back and bend this back out. With these, uh, wheel hangers or uh, sorry wheel studs it, that won't happen so that's uh, another bonus little trick stick the screwdriver into the slot lock it it won't go anywhere and you can torque torque these down
was at this moment that he knew. <sighs> See that? Damn it. I will be right back. Back with another. <laughs> I guess working on cars sometimes it's not a complete job unless you broke a tool or lost one. <sighs> well, that's done. The wheel studs are done. That's it. Time to wash the wheels. I'm gonna just wash them up and put the rims back on. All right, so change the lug nuts to wheel studs. Check something for a future, I don't know if you guys caught it. Check something for a future uh, episode. Washed up the rims. Not a lot, but uh, enough for me for the day. Once again, I apologize for not being upbeat and excited and everything, but I am excited about the, uh, the modification. I'm gonna feel it tomorrow and the next day. Thank you for watching Initial Speed. Like, comment, subscribe. Come on, guys. I know you guys are watching. You're just not hitting that that uh, like, and you're not hitting the uh, subscribe. I know you guys guys can do it. You do it for everybody else. All right. Enjoy the rest of your night, and initial speed out.